What's up guys, welcome back to another Fortnite video on my channel. I'm your boy Wokey, and there's a lot of information. Galactus, Venom skin from the Venom uh, Cup that was today. More skins that are coming as well. No leaks, in, or I'm not going to be good at giving away anything, so no spoilers when it comes to the live event. So guys, grab a chair, grab some popcorns, you don't want to miss out on any of this information right here, right now. If you guys are new to my Zwilke channel, and, or if you guys have a returning back, make sure you guys are subscribed down below by hitting that red bar icon down below, and then hit the bell icon as well so you guys never miss a video when I do post a video, because it definitely helps out my channel when you guys do subscribe, comment, like, and share for the analytics and stuff like that. It just overall helps. Love the comments. Lo love reading you guys' comments when it's theories, opinions, to help you guys out and stuff like that. I just like reading them out. So make sure you guys are commenting down below and then also subscribing, watching, and liking as well. So without further ado, we are here to look at one Galactus update, which, not to spoil or anything, but Galactus is nowhere to be seen at all. Still, people are speculating that he's underneath the map. People are speculating that he's he went back up to space. We don't know where he is, is, but we have an idea of how big Galactus is going to be. But first off, we're going to be looking at the new skins. Obviously, we're going to look at Venom and how he looks because people are going to be winning him and going into the game and showing off that bad to the bone character and I'm telling you right now this has got to be the most sickest skin ever and he's bigger than Brutus so let's get into it um let's get into the skins I'm gonna pop it up on screen right now this is Venom on Hypex website if you guys can take a look at Venom this is how he's going to look how he's going to move is shown right here got two different variations which is sick his pickaxe is part of his body he's got a ball back and then he emotes a scream which is freaking amazing so I can't wait for this I'm a little bummed out that there's no there's no um, glider there's no um, contrail I mean, we can't be too picky when it comes to this, but looking at the two different variations, which is super awesome, looking at all those little symbiote tentacles coming off of Venom, I love it. I'm a little bummed out that they didn't make it where it's Eddie Brock, and then he somehow, like, does, not does, like, an Iron Man thing, but he ends up getting in, in, in I don't even know how to say it, engulfed in the symbiote but i'm a but i mean we can't ask too much but still the back bling though i don't know why it's a ball um it could have been like heads or something i mean we tried calling it guys on the channel but i mean we can only say so much but looking at the other skins that are on here um are actually decent but kind of like what um, so starting off with it, obviously we'll pull up here. So obviously we've got some more dark skins that are going to be coming here soon. We'll talk about it that Kevin has been found in the files as revamped. So we'll talk about that in a different episode on my channel because I want to talk about Kevin and more skins that are coming. But obviously we got the symbiote slasher. We have Venom's outfit. I am so excited about this. If we open this up and you guys take a look at it even more... This is what Venom is going to look like. I just, I'm so excited. Both my favorite villain and favorite hero, Venom and Iron Man, are in the same game. I, I can't wait. I'm, I'm like a little schoolgirl right now. But, <laughs> with that being said, we got the emote, which also the symbiote slasher and the, the emote are only going to be used for Venom. So you're not going to be able to use these for anybody else but Venom. So please take into consideration that you're not going to be able to use these two on any other character. Moving on, we have these two skins that we talked about not too long ago. Um, they are a possibility of going to be a PS5 exclusive, um, but we're not going to talk about that in this one. But then we have this character, Minnens Meat? I, 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 I don't know. <laughs> so, it's a meat pie. Um, with Thanksgiving coming up, obviously this is going to be right up the alley. I just... 
I don't know how to feel about this one, <laughs> this skin. Um, it looks funny and creepy all at the same time. Um, let me know what you guys think about this mincemeat character. It just said made with love and meat. Um, I just don't know what to think about this. It, <laughs> I just don't. And then there's a pot behind him that's stirring the meat pie. I, if you guys, if you guys use this skin, I'm, I, I don't know. I just, I don't know what they're thinking. They're like, okay, when they sat around the, when they, when they were thinking about this skin and they're like, like sitting around the table at Epic, they're like, okay guys, what kind of skin we're going to do? Some guy was like, I got one. It's called mince meat and it looks like a pie, but a, a skin. <laughs> I, I, no, oh, I just don't get it. So moving on from mince meat and stir baby is going to be your next character, which we have is the cute little Peely, but in a corn on the cob look. This is him. So his name is Cobb. Shake off that husk and grab some butter. So apparently this one is also going to be reactive. So when you start killing or when you get kills, some of these corn cobs or the kernels are actually going to pop like popcorn. So I thought this was kind of cool, kind of quirky. Um, I just, <laughs> it's just the food that's, it's really getting me because, <laughs> so if you guys look, there's, there's the variations right here. So you got this one and then you got this one and then you got this one. <laughs> what the crap? I just don't, I just don't understand what they were thinking at this, I just, They're like trying to come up with good skins for like each holiday. And they just, I don't know. Pretty soon we're going to have a tomato. We're going to have a potato. We're going to have all the different food groups here. So, but moving on from that guys, the next one is going to be the heart stopper. She's going to have two different variations, a white and red version or a white and then black version. Um, apparently people are speculating also this is going to come out with a possible subscription that will come through Fortnite. The way that they're going to do it is you're going to pay a lump sum, which is like $14.99 a month. You're going to get like a thousand V bucks, the, the battle pass or something like that. And then some, or the ability to get skins early and stuff like that. They're just trying to do something with the, I know it's, it's being tested. It's not necessarily a given right now, but it's going to be a possibility. So, the next skin, but this one's skin is going to be um, blue rarity. It just says assassins trained. Um, let me pop it up here again. Assassins trained to leave nothing but broken hearts in her wake. Um, I would see this one being more like a Valentine's Day kind of skin because it's called Heart Stopper and she's breaking hearts, kind of like the opposite of love. She's breaking the hearts, but this one's coming out. Um, we'll definitely see the other version here. Um, so we got the black and red, and then we got a red and white or a pink and white um i still think it's cool because it looks like a character from like mortal Kombat. um so if we pull it up here i'm really digging the white better to be honest the white and red and black looks a lot better um on that character so with that being said that one's gonna be coming here soon we have another character called ice raider with obviously the christmas season coming around the corner and with being winter and stuff like that, she looks like she's going to be cold um, in that outfit. Um, but she's very bedazzled being an ice stopper. Um, but that one is going to be another one that's going to be coming here soon. Soon, Not soon. All these skins that you guys are seeing. We have one last skin here. This one just says synthetic diamonds needs not apply. It's a blue rarity, so it's not going to be too bad. It's going to be 1200 V-Buck. Uh, we talked about Powerhouse not too long ago, but this one is like being a secret kind of skin. Um, but we talked about this in the last video, but people are speculating this is Slurp Juice, that they're still s experimenting with Slurp Juice. Um, and it's being, this character is being powered by Slurp Juice. It just says Elite Vendor Tech Electro Trooper. Um, but it's just very odd that this one's coming out of nowhere and it shows kind of like Slurp Juice looking kind of thing. Um, the next one we have back 
scratcher never stand still give us hard as you get that's what she said um but moving on from this this one is definitely just a they use the head from the normal skin, but I like the colors. I just wish they would have done something with her head or hair. Give her a, like a helmet or some head piece. It just looks like she's unfinished on the top part, but I love the concept, the pink, the green, the black, and stuff like that. So, But I, I just wish they would have done a little bit more when it comes to a helmet of some sort of that. But with that being said, that is it for the new skins. Obviously, we'll see more skins when the new battle pass comes out after December 3rd because that will be the next date for December 3rd for the battle pass. It's going to be probably Christmassy theme obviously because Christmas is coming right around the corner and obviously people have speculated too that we're not going to be done I don't think as well that we're not going to be done with said Marvel characters. There's also a sneak character that's at the end that I'm going to talk to you about called the Galaxy Queen. You guys possibly know who she is. Comment down below right now. But we're going to be moving on to one character right now we're going to be talking about. And that is Galactus. The planet eater, the devourer of worlds. Obviously in, uh, obviously in the files, there's two different variations or two different events that I don't want to give away. The f I can give them away, but it's not going to hurt anything. The first one is obviously the devourer of worlds. We obviously know that is going to be Galactus himself. The next one is prepare for all or prepare and protect from all reality. I think I'm speculating a little bit off into that or not speculating, but going off on that sentence there. But those are the two things that are in the files for said event. I don't want to say any more. I don't want to say anything more. But another concept that a care or person made was this uh, was made by EA Skate Concepts. Uh, it definitely looks like the character that's going to be coming to Fortnite. Obviously, it looks like a very well done version of Galactus. Um, but but moving on from this, guys, the next character from the the gal or the the what's it called? Um, just lost my train of thought. But going on from that skin, guys, since I lost my train of thought. The skin that we obviously saw just now, which was a concept, it could be a possibility because looking at this leaked image, this is showing how big Galactus is going to be compared to the war table. Not the war table, but the island. If you can see in the middle where the authority was or is the broken part of it, and you see Galactus and how he is, we can't even imagine how big this character is going to be. I mean, we thought... Travis Scott was big when it came to the, the the event for his concert or the Ice King when we saw him push the storm towards us and stuff like that. This is on a whole nother scale and I can't wait. So, that being said, the next character that people are speculating, or not speculating, but we found in-game leaks is going to be called the Galaxy Queen and that is aka, not that one, it's going to be <laughs> Captain Marvel herself. Captain Marvel is going to come and help us. Obviously, we've seen in this image, which I was going to give to you first, on the top left, you see Captain Marvel up in the top left. But people are still saying, where the heck is going to be Wakanda, or the Wakanda King, the Black Panther? People are just upset about it. They should have had this not too long ago, but not to talk to it or talk much about the Black Panther. But the uh, Captain Marvel herself will be making her debut around the next event, which is the um, the not the not the event, but the one million cup, which is going to be on Saturday the twenty first. People are saying that you're gonna be able to buy it before or after. I think we're going to see her after of the event, or not the event, but of the tournament for the 1 million. So, with that being said, comment down below when you think we're going to be getting Captain Marvel. Is a guarantee that we're going to be getting Captain Marvel? People keep saying, is Wilkie, where is Captain Marvel? Where is Black Panther? Captain Marvel, I can say without a doubt, is coming 100%. Black Panther, we still do not have any idea when the Wakanda King is coming. Hopefully, before this event... 
I'm not quite sure because they have said before after this event with Galactus, which is going to be life-changing for the world of Fortnite, we're going to still have a tie story with Marvel. That could leave a whole bunch of things. It could be Spider-Man because we have Venom. I mean, we could have Black Panther. We could have Ant. We still haven't seen Ant-Man. We have Ant-Man's location in the world of Fortnite right now. We have the collector's place of in the in Fortnite. We have Black Panther's place. We I, there's a lot of things that are not. There is eyes that are not dotted and T's that are not crossed. And we definitely need to figure this out before the live event that will happen on the 28th of November. So make sure you guys jot that down. And then we'll get the new battle pass on December 3rd. But I'm a little stuck of, of what the theory could be with this end of end event. So comment down below. Tell me what you guys are thinking. Where is Galactus? Is he under the map? Is he behind the, the mountain? Where is he? Comment down below. I would surely appreciate it. Make sure you guys subscribe, like I said, and, and like the video. And I'll see you guys in the next video. So keep it real. Keep it safe. And we'll see you guys next time. And as always, keep nerding on. And we'll see you guys next time. Peace.